how to install a central processing unit that are known as CPU. So here's the processor itself. A key characteristic that we will be looking at and focusing on is down here. If we look, we can see a small arrow. So here's my motherboard. If we zoom in a little more, this is where the CPU is gonna sit inside. And if we look just a little closer and we pay attention to the bottom left corner, we're gonna see another arrow. That's the arrow you're gonna match up with the arrow that's on the processor itself. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna start by pulling out this little arm. And just pull it to the side just like this lift it up so we can gain access and what we're going to want to do is remove this cover just by pulling it off pull it back and now we have access to where we want to install our cpu next we're going to pull our cpu out of the packaging And what we're going to want to do is line up our arrows accordingly. So that just fits right in there. We're going to close down this lid. All right. And you're going to hear a little clicking sound. All right. Boom. That part is installed. Next, I'll be applying a thermal compound on top of the CPU. Even though the fan does come pre-applied, it's always best to add a tad more. Make sure your surface is clean. I'm just gonna add a little, tiny bit. Next, we'll be installing the fan and wiring it up. If you look on the opposite end, it did come pre-applied with thermal compound, but for safety purposes, I always like to add more. So if we look closely, there's four holes that will line up perfectly with your fan. So what you wanna do is just line those up. Okay. pop them into place. One, two, three, four. The last and final step is to power up your fan. So what you'll be looking for is a four pin terminal near your processor. And right here we can see that mine is labeled right there. CPU, fan one, I'm just gonna plug in. So here's where we're, where we're gonna make our connections. We're gonna use this right here as reference. Okay, this can only go in one way. So you're just gonna push it in, line it up, push it in, and you're done. And there you go. Successful CPU install. The position or the sticker of your fan should not matter. I just want the sticker facing me because my setup does happen to start this way. This is a work in progress. If anybody found this video helpful, please drop a like, comment, and subscribe. It really helps the channel grow. Also, if anybody is interested in purchasing this exact same CPU, the link will be in the description, as well as a the thermal compound. See you guys next time.